Welcome back to Budokai Tenkaichi 2. Show yourself, you monster. You're next, Piccolo. How do you know my name? We're brothers, you and I. Dude, Piccolo is an only child. All of his brothers are dead. Ready? Well, I mean, if you switch and save them, brothers. I mean, he is the son of King Piccolo, even though, hell, he is King Piccolo. I mean, yeah. Yeah. Kind of. I mean, he has his memories. And, no. Well, you know what? Forget it. Whatever. Th this is Cell. If you've never freaking seen DBZ before, yeah. This is the guy that, you know, pushes Gohan to his limit. He doesn't seem like much right now, but. Oh, that's because he hasn't absorbed enough humans yet. Seriously, this fight was fucking pointless. Maybe on difficulty level 3 it's harder, but wow, that's short. See what I mean by the fights are anywhere from 20 seconds to 90? Hard fight is like 3 minutes, maybe. Suppress his power level. <sighs> Time to go face off with Android 17. There's nothing else on the map except fighting Cybermen. We're not doing that right now. If you don't talk, I will kill you in no time flat. Got it? Hmm. I won't fall as easily as I did last time. Contrary to belief, no, you don't have any new moves. This isn't Legacy of Goku 2. Ready? Fight! You won't get away! Yeah. Or uh Budokai Tenkaichi 3 actually. <laughs> Because, yeah, finally, in that game, Piccolo does actually get a whole new uh, arsenal of moves. Well, it's not all new, but he does get that like really awesome finish. Too bad that I haven't I already recorded the game already, so I can actually splice that in. But you see how it is. Man, I love that move. He beats the hell out of his opponent. And then he blasts them. You'll see it. Then again, you can probably just look it up right now, but. Uh, but anyway, yeah, this fight was 17. 17 isn't as tough as he was the first time around, but he's still plenty tough. I'm mad. He actually stood there and let me charge that up. Normally, he would have already shot me. So these two are fighting at their peak right now. They aren't trying to conceal power levels or anything. They're trying to actually one up each other. Well, not according to this footage, but I mean, you know, dude, they're really ramping it up. And Cell is picking up on this and he's flying towards us right now. He's on his way because, well, that's his purpose to absorb Android 17 and 18 and become perfect so he can kill Goku. Absorbing, uh, well, reaching perfection is phase one. He was created to be Jarrell's ultimate creation in his revenge against Goku. Somebody was actually wondering, why is he a Goku? Gohan killed him.
Remember this day, the day I become complete. Enough! What's this? <gasps> Did you get to play as Android 17? Yeah. So hopefully you actually stop by the shop before you actually got into this. Because you're going to need some freaking items. Otherwise you're going to have to rely on Piccolo. Uh, sorry about how sporadic that was, but uh, you know, if you pause, you can actually check out what I equipped him with. I don't know, I didn't want to waste two minutes uh, showing what all I struggled to, uh, to figure out. Okay, do I use this? I think I might want to use this. It's, it's like, <clears throat> excuse me, going to the, going to the market, and you know you're comparing, uh, you know, this like one particular apple to like the rest of, of uh, the apples in the bunch, or like you know you're in the canned goods section, and you know you're seeing like this can of uh, what can of corn for like 75 cent. And uh, there's like, you know, another can of corn that's for like 60 cents, you know, and like, huh, which do I want? The one that's cheaper or the one that's a little bit more expensive, but, you know, it's, it's a bit more quality or whatever. Wow, why am I wasting time? Okay, but as you can see, Cell has gotten stronger. And no, he doesn't actually absorb anything from his fellow androids when he actually does his throw which actually does absorb a bit of health and energy from someone. So that's a nice touch. So let's actually tag out, bring Piccolo in to actually finish this off. See? Now if he did that on 17, he wouldn't actually get anything. He's not really um, organic anymore. Well. Uh, that's the thing. Depending on who you ask or what source that you that you're paying attention to, they are still kind of human. I mean, they've just been uh, horrifically modified. I mean, why else the hell can 18 actually have a daughter? You know, later on uh, near the end of Z. Hmm. I'm not going to get into that. Instead, I'm actually going to get pissed off because crazy stuff is about to happen. No, we're not saving. Uh, one more loading screen, so yeah. You mean to tell me that we, yes, we are Android 16, but we're not actually going to go fight Cell right quick, and I really should have actually went to the wasteland for what I'm about to do, because this is about to get me killed. It's a good thing that this isn't uh, like a straight up devoted RPG. Well, not devoted, but a dedicated RPG, because this would have actually gotten, like, uh, this is just poor planning on my part. So, I think, what do I do? Jump cut. <clears throat> this is all that I gave him. That was a mistake. I should have actually said, screw it, to the Blast 2, and actually hooked him up with, um, you know, with a second health, um, Z item, because... I'm fighting Salsa and Cooler in Ready. his final form. Yeah, I have that much health, but look at this. Look how much he shaved off with that. Maybe I should have bolstered my defense. Either way, I don't think I'm properly equipped because Salsa is still fast. And he's still going to give me some problems. And yes, he's got the Hell's Flash, um, she's a rush attack. And then he has Hell's Impact, which is a projectile. It's kind of odd to do that right after doing that throw, because he just launched his arm in order to throw you. Actually, I'm not doing a bad job beating him down until he hits me with that and he shaves off half my health. I mean, a uh, half a health meter. Wow, I'm fighting this bad. Go. Uh, 
excuse me, probably this poorly. Damn it! Came at him at the wild angle. Wait, did he teleport out of the way but I still got him? I like that though. Very uh execution styled. Um speaking of execution, here comes Cooler himself. Oh, uh, for a second I thought I was about to surrender. I'm like, no, I uh, Yeah, here we go with the death chaser. Look at this. I like that from Cooler. The only other thing I'd like to for, to have happen is if he throw you like Super Vegeta does. Like he kick you away. That'd be cool. But yeah, I'm not going to win this. I mean, there's a good chance that I could, but not the way that I'm playing. I mean, I don't really... I mean, Android 16 is a pretty okay character in my book, but trying to play as him is not... It's not my style. I'm not good with any of the androids. Unless I give him like certain buffs and all. Look at that! Somehow he manages... I guess my android barrier was actually uh, weakened. It was just about to uh, to end. And so, you know, his death beam can actually penetrate it. So, I mean, that's, that's not really cheap on the game's part. Because, yeah, the animation was practically over. So I guess that, that uh, the invincibility frame is gone. So, why did I show that off? If I'm only going to fail? Because I want you guys to see what it is that you, uh, that you could do. <clears throat> uh, I'm going to take a break. <laughs> Throat's getting all scratchy. But yeah, now that we've had that little excursion, it's time to go to the islands. Fight Cell. Before meeting with Goku, the time for battle is at hand. <laughs> it seems we have another fool eager to throw his life away. You'll destroy yourself if you face him. By my calculations, my power level is equal to that of yours. Clash of the Titans, number 16 versus Cell. Oh yeah, Ready. it's time to battle. Fight. Now, this actually should be enough to fight Cell, but to fight Salsa and Cooler? Uh-uh, that ain't gonna happen. Alright, glad they... Oh, that was overcast today. It's actually pretty cool. So, yeah, I didn't feel as overwhelmed. Nice, alright, so... Yeah. Um, I don't know, and... Just as I mentioned before, you actually have to wait for your energy to go back up as an android. This is it. Hell flash. So 16 didn't exist in, uh, in uh, the other timeline either. Maybe he did, but he was immediately disassembled after because he was faulty. I mean, Dr. Jero does mention that uh, 16 is faulty and they shouldn't uh, and they shouldn't activate him. But anyway, now that Cell is weak, let's uh, let's get in a little bit closer. Dodge this, and yep, he's out of power now. So I'm taking you with me, and it worked. Whoa, that was too close for comfort. <laughs> Suggestive much? Nah. This isn't Metal Gear, okay? Seriously. Okay, what's up with that face? Really, Sal? That's the face that you're gonna make? Now I have to go and augment him. Cause look at that. Yeah, so now here he is, level 59, not bad. Everything looks pretty decent. 
Um, yeah, once we get the uh, the damn it, why do I keep saying bronze? Once we get the silver card, yeah, I left this in because I want to talk. So since you know, well, once I get the silver card, ready? Then hell, once I get the gold card, everybody will be maximized. You know, they'll be um, at the balance that I want them to be. Actually, it probably won't be balanced considering that I don't even actually bump up their key unless it's like a supplemental effect from another item. Such as, uh, like, uh, rage or charge or whatever. Okay, so, for this battle, I'm actually going to try and be as ranged as possible. I don't know. I don't really want to just fight Cell head on. Because check that out, my tri beam almost just uh, just takes out a whole bar of health. And what I'm trying to do is actually just go up for Neo tri beam after I chip him down just enough. Maybe what one more bar to do it. Look at that! You shot me out of the sky. You kind of set yourself up to uh, to miss like that, dude. And just as we did with Nappa, the Neo tri beam takes off like almost a whole health bar. Per uh, per shot. So let's try this. Yeah, I think it's like a half each shot, and that's practically how it went down. Except I don't think that they fought at all. I'm pretty sure he just stood there and shot the shit out of him, only to pass out. But yeah, hey, there we go. Super Vegeta and Super Saiyan Trunks. All right. Next time, we'll play as them.